And again, thank you so much for joining us here on Idaho Today. It is Idaho Gives. It's a perfect time to give back to one of the countless organizations that make our community a better place. And the Wasmus Center is certainly one of those. The Wasmus Center for Human Rights has been a leader in charitable efforts in the Treasure Valley for decades. Here to tell us more, we have Christina Bruce Bennon. And great to have you here. I know we've spoken to the Wasmus Center a number of times. Um, but for those who may have never visited or they might not be familiar. Give us a little background on the center. Sure, so the Wasma Center was founded in 1996, uh, really to originally to build the Idaho and Frank Human Rights Memorial, mm -hmm. which is in the heart of downtown Boise near the river. And over the years has worked really hard to build educational programming connected to the messages and the ideas in the memorial and about how we yeah, protect human rights and, and further those in our community and beyond. I love that. And, and give a little more detail too on some of those services and the ways that you connect with the community too. Uh, help with human rights. Yeah, so we have a variety of programs and resources. We work with educators and around the state. We work with students in K through 12, and uh, just also have programs for the community where people can come, learn, talk, talk to each other, and just deepen their understanding. And we hope be inspired to take action in positive ways. Great. Well, during Idaho Gives, what is the biggest need that you guys are looking for right now? Yeah, so we have um, uh, just some great programs that are new in our landscape that we are building support for. And so uh, they are programs like our Conversations at the Center and programs for young learners. So we will have a new reading program for young children starting uh, at the end of the summer. And so just working on a variety of projects like that to connect with a broader range of of learners. Love that. And then also, too, you guys are, are opening an expanded center. That's we exciting. Are. We are. Now that it's May 1st, we can officially say we're taking possession Yay! next month at the end of June. So we're super excited about that. And um, and so, yeah, there will be more opportunities. So some of these programs that we're looking to support through Idaho Gives are because we're going to have the expanded ability in the new building to That's offer those exciting. programs. So. Um, and two, um, in particular, as a parent, uh, I was super excited to find out that you have opportunities, too, for teens. Yes. Yeah. So our Wasmuth Youth Leadership Program is a year-long program for 9th through 12th graders. And so we have a new cohort starting with about 32 kids. So we're super wow. excited. And yeah, they just are with us for a whole year and they do a lot of learning and then they develop projects to make a better community. So. Give, it, give us an example too of some of the things that uh, those teens will be doing as a part of that stewardship in, in this project. Yeah, so we try to really... Um, in addition to supporting their own learning, mm -hmm. we, we really look for opportunities for the students themselves to drive a lot of what interests them. And so there's a lot of shared learning early in the program. So that could be books, podcasts, um, speakers, whatever. And then, and then they really come together and they develop different projects. So this last year, for example, one group in our cohort, they decided to do a book drive for one of the Title I schools, elementary schools that um, could always use more books than the hands of their students and other students did projects that related to um, other kinds of human rights education or more involvement in the community so a real wide variety but we love to have the students um, be leaders in the program too yes so. love that okay so Idaho gives as mentioned, happening as we speak. Yes. How do people give back to the Wasma Center? So they can go uh, on our website, wasmacenter.org. It's also out on social media. And um, just also want to do a quick shout out to the Idaho Nonprofit Center for organizing this tremendous statewide effort mm -hmm. to support nonprofits. And yeah, we just appreciate all the support. So. Wonderful. And then where can people go so they can learn more too about the expanded center, come visit, and also learn more about your programs? Yeah, so again, our website, wasmacenter.org org and um, the the community will also be welcome to a grand opening later in the summer so stay Yay. tuned for that we'll have more information excellent so. super excited and thank you so much for all you do here. yes well thank you greatly appreciate that all right everybody